The Parable of the Leaven A parable is a short allegorical story that is meant to illustrate a truth or moral lesson. We read in the Bible that Jesus spoke in parables, meaning that his stories and many of his words were never meant to be understood literally as they contain hidden principles. In my opinion, religious adherence to a literal interpretation of scripture concealed much of the meaning behind Jesus' stories, stories that were intended to be understood figuratively. How shall I liken the kingdom of God? It is like leaven, which a woman took and hid in three measures of flour until the whole was leavened. Leaven was typically a small batch of older fermented dough containing yeast and good bacteria. This mixture was alive and stored for later use when it would be added to a much larger batch of dough to cause it to rise by creating a foaming action that would lighten and soften it. In this parable, we read that a small amount of leaven hidden within a large amount of dough will eventually affect the entire batch, causing it to rise. The point is twofold. One, there is something unseen hidden within the whole. Two, this hidden thing will eventually affect the entire whole. But what does the parable of leaven mean in light of the kingdom of God? First, we must understand what the kingdom of God is and what it is not. We read in the Bible that Jesus said, the kingdom of God is at hand, meaning here now. Repent, meaning change your thinking. He also said, the kingdom of God is within you. Jesus' core message was that the kingdom of God, or heaven in Matthew, was at hand, meaning it is present now and not coming in the future. The kingdom is invisible and not something outside of us because it is within us. Now that we know what the kingdom is and is not, it's easier to understand what this parable means. The parable of the leaven reveals that there is something hidden within all of us. The kingdom of God, our divine essence. Call it God, divinity, life, energy, our core being, whatever you prefer. It is something greater than our brain and body. Many remain unaware of the life within them because our growth and awareness can be a process of varying speeds. Like the leaven, this divine essence is a living organism that is growing, rising within humanity now, causing every one of us to elevate, to grow, to be full of abundant life flowing from the inside out. It is a transformation from our old way of solely receiving information from our five senses and brain to seeking answers now from within our deepest being beyond our mental processes. And by accessing the kingdom of God now, we can experience inner stillness, peace, joy, love, and wisdom as who we truly are within our being, the divine, the God that is within us and is us. Be sure to subscribe to my channel and watch my other videos as I will continue to share more of my experiences and practices 